Welcome to the library, everybody. I'm Dan Neves, and today I'm at the Downtown Library with librarian Justin Stevenson. Welcome, Justin. Yeah, great to be here. This is the first time we've ever got to interview you, so uh, welcome to the club. Thank it's official. you. Thank you. You work for Siouxland now. <laughs> And we're going to talk to you today because you're a librarian for the system in charge of our databases. Mm -hmm. And we've got a pretty significant and exciting change uh, with our database offerings. So mm -hmm. we know for the last couple of years we've had Gale courses. Mm -hmm. Well, we no longer have Gale courses. And while that might come to a shock, I and mean, some people have really enjoyed Gale, we have something quite better. Yeah. So what do we have? So we, we did have Gale, and that, but now we have lynda.com, which has been around for about 20 years now. It's an online learning platform. I think it has about 4,000 courses now, 40,000 videos, and they're adding new ones every single day. Um, the nice thing about Lynda that's different from Gale is uh, it's, you can go at your own pace, and you can watch exactly what little videos you want and take them and save them, come back to them later. There's no deadlines. The Gale was a great service, but Gale had deadlines. You had to enroll. If you didn't meet those deadlines, then you had to wait a couple months until the next one opened up. But Linda, you can do everything at your own pace. Right. And the other thing that, that you said that I don't know if everybody caught yet, but my favorite part, you get to watch videos. Mm -hmm. With Gale, that was very limited. Yes. Uh, with Linda, almost everything's a video, and it's in bite-sized chunks. I can watch a 15-minute video rather than a three-hour-long thing. Yep. Yep, different courses are different lengths. Some of them are as short as 10 minutes or 15 minutes, and some are more involved. They're an hour, hour and a half, but they're always split into little bite-sized chunks. So if you if you know something, a specific thing, and you don't want to have to sit through it, you can skip it and go on to the next one and keep sure. going that way, yeah. I like it. How can I use lynda.com? Can anybody just use it? Do I need a library card? Mm -hmm. uh, how does that work? So everyone with an active, uh, library card, the Siouxland Libraries, in good standing, can use it. And what you do the first time, you would go through our website, you'd go SiouxlandLIB.org, go through research a topic, and then you would go down to Linda, go through there. The first time you use it, you have to make an account, and you'll need your library card number then. And after that, you only have to make the account once, and then you always want to go through our website to get to Linda. And that's it. It's free for everyone to use with the Siouxland Libraries card. That's right. And that's why you go through our website, because mm -hmm. we pay for it for you, Yep. which is pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. All right. And you can get certificates. Yep. Is that correct? Yep. You can get certificates of completion. And because Linda is actually a LinkedIn product, LinkedIn uh, purchased Linda uh, two years ago now, you can post those onto your LinkedIn profile. You can print them out. You can send them to your employer, to your supervisor, anything like that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. And one thing I like with Linda too is when I when I'm going through. Sometimes I have two minutes, three minutes, and I want to see what's available. Mm -hmm. I can add it to a playlist for myself, mm -hmm. so I can come back to it later. Yep. You can and you can make pretty much as many playlists as you to your heart. You know, make them to your heart's content. You can, you know, say these are communication courses I want to save and come back to later. And you can save whole courses, you can save little pieces of different courses to these playlists and save them for later. Nice. Yeah. I like it. Mm -hmm. This is really exciting stuff. I mean, Gail was great, but Linda, mm -hmm. I, I think, is hands down mm -hmm. far superior. Uh, do I have to do this all on my own? Can I get help getting started? Yeah, of course. You can always come down here and we can help you. Or you can email our Ask a Librarian email, which is libask at siouxfalls.org, and we'll be happy to help you out. Awesome. So stop in, mm -hmm. email us yep. from our Ask a Librarian, or you can give us a call. Yep. That's 367-8720 uh, to call our information desk here at the Downtown Library. But any location will be able to help mm -hmm. you set up, and then you can do this from home. You don't yeah. have to be in the building. Nope. Yep, you can use you can use it here, or you can use it at home. You can use it on your computer. You can use it on your phone. If you do use it on your phone, you can't use the app, but you can use a mobile browser, and so you, you can access it, take these classes anywhere. All right. And some classes also have offline courses or files that you can download, like study, study materials that will kind of accentuate and complement the course as well. Transcripts, all that yep, good stuff. Yep, yeah. transcripts. Exactly. Awesome. Check it out, guys. Lynda.com uh, through Sioux Lane Library. So visit our website, go to research a topic, mm -hmm. find lynda.com, go sign yourself up for an account. It's free. There's no limitations, is there? I don't, nope. I'm not limited to 10 videos a month or 10 courses a month. Nope. You can watch as many, as many as you want for as long as you want. You can, yep, no, no limit at all. I like it. 
I like it. Stop by and see us if you need help. Give us a call. Uh, email us through Ask a Librarian. Just sign up for Linda. Let us know what you think of it. And uh, we'll see you next time. <laughs>